So for our final resident reader, which is the place of honor, <laughs> we have Lewis Edwards. He's a junior English major, originally from far off Melbourne, Australia. He enjoys producing music, writing stories, and taking irresponsibly long naps in his spare time. After finishing his degree at Texas A&M, he plans to attend library school. Lewis Edwards. Hi, everyone. Uh, my name is Lewis Edwards. My piece I'm going to read tonight is entitled Gossamer Wings, or Why the Waiting is the Hardest Part. It is a series of 46 short letters the young man writes to his girlfriend who has just recently left his life. I am starting here at the seventh letter. Seven. The man at the library let me rent out a movie, even though I lost my library card, which I think I left in the right pocket of your jacket when you went away. The movie is The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe, and features some loser kids, and also Tilda Swinton, whom I like very much. I watched all of her scenes twice and studied her face and her cheekbones. Her beauty is frigid and aspirational. Eight. I think if I could be anyone, I would be Tilda Swinton. I would look at children hopscotching on the playground and slice them in two with my sharp, sharp cheekbones. I would stand with my legs far apart and talk at length about my savage beauty. I would star in feature films. Nine. I dreamt that Tilda Swinton came to take you away in a green metal supercar with big flame stickers on the windows. Tilda Swinton told me that you'll be getting back as soon as you can, but that I needed to prepare for it. Tilda Swinton was exactly who I wanted her to be, and a little bit more. 10. I dashed out of the convenience store at 3 a.m. to buy ramen to crush up. I'm going to put all the crumbled noodles into a bowl, and I'm going to dip my hands in the bowl and pour bits and pieces of dehydrated noodle slush mess all over myself. My room is getting smaller and smaller every day without you in it. 11. I wrote a story about us, and I'm going to write this story all over the walls so that you can read it if you come back and I have left. It goes like this. Once upon a time, there was a little spider sitting in her web, and the spider was you, and she had your name, and she was wonderful. One day a fly got caught in the spider's web and said, please don't eat me, I don't want to die like this. And the spider said, you think I'm going to harm you, but I am not. You think I'm trapping you, but I am not, and I never have and never will. The fly said, you are right, but I won't let you be. Then the spider rolled over in its big, beautiful, sparkling diamond web and said, I'm going to lay down for a while. Do not wake me until I choose to get up. And the fly said, okay, I love you very much. When you get back, I'll read this to you in my best Tilda Swinton impression, and you'll be very proud of how I have grown as an actor. 12. The man at the library agreed to let me rent every movie that Tilda Swinton has been featured in. I will watch all these movies and create a ranking of them for you to look at later in case you want to know how I felt. I will not make you read it if you don't want to read it. 13. I miss you and I want you to come back soon and I want you to know that in that story I wrote, the fly loved the spider very, very much and the fly would be really happy to see the spider stand up and say, I was pulling a joke on you, you silly fool, you idiot waste, you moron. Twat, you have the poor judgment of someone who punches big crater holes in the wall when his girlfriend dies. 14. I am changing the story to where the spider says, Actually, I think I would like to go away and make your wretched little fly life completely miserable, and then you can write bullshit, sad sack stories about me that you can read to all your loser friends. Then the spider is hit head on by Tilda Swinton's dynamo, mint green supercar, and dies on impact and gets spider guts all over the flame window stickers. 15. I am a quarter of the way through my ranking of Tilda Swinton films. Each film I watch twice because I need to be thorough and because I have nothing better to do. The Lion, the Witch, and the Wardrobe is still my favorite because that one reminds me of you and of the hard spider that sits in its fat, stupid web all day and draws people in and never lets them out. 16. I dreamt I was trapped in the inner lining of your stomach. I was a fly and I was being digested. You swallowed me and you did not care. I think you are more like an asshole fly killer than anything else. <laughs> I'm going to start killing every spider I see. 17. I want to be Tilda Swinton. I'm going to deglove my arms and replace my pinkish skin with alabaster perfect Swinton skin, and I'm going to accept foreign acting awards and be very good at my job because that is what Tilda Swinton is the very best at. As Tilda Swinton, I will melt down all of my award statuettes and mold them into a big metal spider shape. 18. The teller at the convenience store started to recognize my ugly blowfly face. My proboscis splurts disgusting fly juice in his lap, and he's begun to notice it. I will start to go to a different convenience store at 3 a.m. to get more ramen, and I will crumble up and pour into the toilet. 19. 
I won't need you if time is recursion. I can spend all of it watching wonderful Tilda Swinton movies. I will marry her and we will both wear dresses and kiss each other on chase lounges or whatever it is that pretty, scary people do. And I will talk about my fly and spider story and she will like it and know that she is the web. 20. My lamp is beginning to fizzle out and I cannot get bulbs at the convenience store. I'm going to let my lamp go out because the hardware store is not on my list of acceptable places to go. Every bad place is a place you like to be at. Every bad place is another putrid, knotted, weeping, wet. Thank you.